Listen to this next story. Bereaved families are seeking justice for six bouncers who were murdered in cold blood during a funeral of Johannes Okoth, a local trader in Masabula village, Busia County, on Friday. On the morning, families of the slain men were today at Ahero Mortuary to identify the bodies of the six who were allegedly hired to provide security during the funeral of Johannes, who was murdered two weeks ago. Mm. Elfa Slagat now reports. Raw emotions. <laughs> Disbelief. These were the scenes at Ahero Mortuary in Nyando, Kisumu County. Family, friends and neighbors of the six men who were lynched in Bumala can barely comprehend how their kin were beaten to death on suspicion of murder. After failing to identify themselves, at the viewing of the body of slain businessman Johannes Okoth. At least, watu kama awal, natakana watafutwe, serikali watafutwe, will bring out a book so that uh, Initial reports suggest that the bodies of William Odongo, Elias Sisko, Elvis Odoyo, Evans Onyango, Richard Odero, Elias Nick, David Okeo, and Philip Kwach were found in separate spots in Masebula village in Busia County. William Omondi's widow, Maureen Atieno, among those who came to identify the bodies, she has been left to be the breadwinner for the three children they had. <laughs> Nine years, Munya Namfuata, Hakona five years, Dogo Hakona one year three, one, one year three months. Sijinta Jifan Ajina Watoto. Philip Quart grew up an orphan. He too fell victim to the mob, and his guardian is demanding quick action from the authorities. The fact that you have dressed in a similar manner, you can be in a women group, you have dressed like yeah, according to your group. The fact that these people are in suits, they're not to put them to be, you know, gangsters. All those who died were aged between 20 and 35. Local authorities have slammed Bumala residents for taking the law into their hands, with investigations currently underway to unearth individuals who participated in the cold blood murder of the six men, whose families are still devastated with the turn of events. Alpha Slagat, Citizen TV.